Welcome continental to today's breakfast video, explained. where we'll be exploring Anna Udenberg's Continental Breakfast Exhibition at the Meredith Rosen Gallery in New York City. The exhibition features a site, specific solo display of Udenberg's new work, which includes distorted, sexualized sculptures that speak to the body as an asset to modify and control in order to relinquish autonomy to user-friendly technologies. The artist's work materializes at the eroding boundary between object and human, where the modification of bodies through digital and medical procedures and the humanization of industrial design through touchscreens, organic shapes, and ergonomic design come crashing together. In this video, we'll be diving deeper into Udenberg's exploration of functionality and control, as well as the symbolism behind the exhibition's title, Continental Breakfast. We'll also examine the artist's translation of symbolic values of real estate textures, skins, veneer, and steel crowd control blockades into sculptural materiality. Join us as we take a closer look at the thought provoking works on display and consider the ways in which they challenge our perceptions of the body, technology, and control. Anna Udenberg's work in Continental Breakfast at the Meredith Rosen Gallery provokes our willingness to submit to user-friendly technologies by taking the anesthetic armature of our increasingly automated environment and distorting it into sexualized pseudo-functional sculptures. The works in this exhibition speak specifically to the body as an asset to modify and control, ultimately rendering it useless, all while on view for public consumption. Udenberg questions the degree to which we are willingly seduced by algorithms in an increasingly data-driven world. Pulling from the aesthetics of airline seats, hospital architecture, and hotel design, Udenberg's sculptures express a hyper-functionality that is inaccessible to human use. Her work materializes at the eroding boundary between object and human where the modification of bodies through digital and medical procedures and the humanization of industrial design through touch screens, organic shapes, and organic shapes, and ergonomic design come crashing together. Udenberg's exploration of functionality and control expands on her fascination with making life efficient. In our effort to streamline our daily routines, we ultimately change our conception of selfhood on the rhythmic dopamine drip of updates, notifications, and information excess. The exhibition's title, Continental Breakfast, refers to the free breakfast offered at hotels, which is a replica of the light morning meals common throughout the European continent. A simulacrum of breakfast offered to the body in transit, the seemingly luxurious experience is projected onto cheap, mediocre food. Similar to an airplane meal, the body in transit seeks to rectify its authority as it submits to a controlled environment. Throughout the exhibition, Udenberg translates symbolic values of real estate textures, skins, veneer, and the sheen of steel crowd control blockades into sculptural materiality. These quasi-functional objects of financial domination provide the stage on which performers surrender their bodily autonomy. Stuck in a feedback loop of user-friendly technology, interface, and industrial design, our behavior contorts in the navigation of both physical and digital realms. Anna Udenberg's sculptures in Continental Breakfast at the Meredith Rosen Gallery express a hyperfunctionality that is inaccessible to human youth. The works draw from the aesthetics of airline seats, hospital architecture, and hotel design to create an environment that speaks to the body as an asset to modify and control. Udenberg sculptures materialize at the eroding boundary between object and human. The artist explores the ways in which the modification of bodies through digital and medical procedures and the humanization of industrial design through touch screens, organic shapes, and ergonomic design come crashing together in our increasingly automated environment. The sculptures question the degree to which we are willingly seduced by algorithms in an increasingly data-driven world. In this exhibition, Udenberg expands on her fascination with functionality as a mode of control. As we strive to make our lives more efficient, we ultimately change our conception of selfhood on the rhythmic dopamine drip of updates, notifications, and information excess. The title of the exhibition, Continental Breakfast, 
refers to the free breakfast offered at hotels, which is a replica of the light morning meals common throughout the European continent. This simulacrum of breakfast offered to the body in transit is projected onto cheap, mediocre food. Similar to an airplane meal, the body in transit seeks to rectify its authority as it submits to a controlled environment. Uddenberg sculptures translate symbolic values of real estate textures, skins, veneer, and the sheen of steel crowd control blockades into sculptural materiality. These quasi-functional objects of financial domination provide the stage on which performers surrender their bodily autonomy. Stuck in a feedback loop of user, friendly technology, interface, and industrial design, our behavior contorts in the navigation of both physical and digital realms. Overall, Uddenberg sculptures in Continental Breakfast Challenge are perceptions of the body, technology, and control. By distorting the anesthetic armature of our automated environment into sexualized, pseudo-functional sculptures, the artist urges us to reconsider the ways in which we relinquish our autonomy to user, friendly technologies. The title of Anna Uddenberg's solo exhibition at the Meredith Rosen Gallery, Continental Breakfast, carries symbolic significance that adds to the conceptual depth of the works on display. The title refers to the light breakfast commonly offered in hotels throughout the European continent, but Unberg's sculptures suggest a deeper symbolism that comments on our relationship to technology, control, and luxury. In an age of increasing automation and efficiency, Uddenberg sculptures invite us to consider the ways in which we submit our autonomy to user, friendly technologies. The title Continental Breakfast alludes to the idea of luxury and aspirational values projected onto cheap, mediocre food. Similarly, Uddenberg sculptures present a hyper-functional environment that is inaccessible to human use, questioning the ways in which we are willingly seduced by algorithms in an increasingly data-driven world. The hotel, with its promise of comfort and convenience, is a key symbol in Udenberg's work. The artist explores the ways in which the hotel, as a single domino in the chain of events in cities, increasingly inhospitable to everyone but the ultra-wealthy, represents a controlled environment in which the body in transit seeks to rectify its authority. Udenberg translates symbolic values of real estate textures, skins, veneer, and the sheen of steel crowd control, blockades, into sculptural materiality, suggesting a link between luxury and financial domination. The sculptures in Continental Breakfast thus provide the stage on which performers surrender their bodily autonomy, stuck in a feedback loop of user-friendly technology, interface, and industrial design. Through her provocative and thought-provoking works, Anna Uddenberg invites us to reconsider the ways in which we relate to technology, control, and luxury in our daily lives. Anna Uddenberg's Continental Breakfast Exhibition at the Meredith Rosen Gallery features a series of sculptures that challenge our notions of functionality and control. Pulling from the aesthetics of airline seats, hospital architecture, and hotel design, Uddenberg distorts the anesthetic armature of our increasingly automated environment into sexualized pseudo-functional sculpture. The sculptures in Continental Breakfast speak specifically to the body as an asset to modify and control in order to relinquish autonomy to user, friendly technologies. Similar to a um, BDSM contractual agreement, the body is willingly supported, entrapped, pampered, and ultimately rendered useless, all while on view for public consumption. Huddenberg questions the degree to which we are seduced by algorithms in an increasingly data. The sculptures express a hyper-functionality that is inaccessible to human use, creating a boundary between object and human that is constantly eroding. Uddenberg's work materializes at the intersection of the modification of bodies through digital and medical procedures and the humanization of industrial design through touchscreens, organic shapes, and ergonomic design. The quasi-functional objects featured in Continental Breakfast represent financial domination and control. Uddenberg translates symbolic values of real estate textures, skins, veneer, and the sheen of steel crowd control blockades into sculptural materiality, suggesting a link between luxury 
and financial domination 